the primary is over. You know, we had we had four candidates running. Uh, I actually had friends who were supporting, you know, or I had friends in each one of the four camps, believe it or not. And um, uh, I stayed out of it as far as a, uh, an endorsement goes. Uh, but now, Rounders are candidate. And I think you have to look at it. I, you know, no one, no one's more pro-life than me. I am conflicted um, because on one hand, um, Bruce Rauner says that he believes life begins at conception, but then he says he believes in the right for a woman to kill that life that began at conception. Basically saying, I'm, I'm conflicted. I, I don't know where I am uh, right now on this issue. I don't think I can answer the question, uh, the question the way it was asked because I cannot bring myself to vote for, for Bruce Rauner. Um, <laughs> With the second highest unemployment rate in Illinois and likely to climb higher if, the, if we can't turn around this economy, funds for crisis pregnancy centers, for rights to life groups, for Illinois Family Institute, They dry up. If someone can't afford to they have a roof over their head, they can't write a check to Dave Smith and IFI. Excellent. So vote for the pro-deaf candidate so I Dave have, Smith can get more help. <laughs> strictly fought in the legislature. That battle is not fought in the courts, it's not fought alone in the legislature, it's not fought alone in the schools. The first two gentlemen, to Mr. Morrison and uh, Mr. Tucker, you basically kind of, I mean you both like Rauner, but you basically kind of said, primary did it, it's over, get on board. There no conservative, no Christian would be supporting Bruce Browner under any circumstances, but for one thing, his money. Okay, is it his position on, on life? Is it his position on traditional values? Is it his position on, on, uh, on, uh, on amnesty? Is it his friendship with Ron Emanuel? No. It's the money. This is a family gathering. You can talk about whatever you want. But let me say this. All those issues you mentioned, they're a pipe dream with this, with this legislature. I mean, what, what, what in Bruce Rauner's background gives you any confidence that he's going to do any of those things? What, where, he has no background in politics. He's made billions of dollars in business doing he things. He gets stuff done. He gets to make billions done. of dollars, you got to get stuff John, done. John Corzine got stuff done. When you hear sound bites of people shrieking, no exceptions! Excuse me, that's stunning. Because ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry, I am pro-life and I do believe life begins at the moment of conception. But, there are exceptions. Now, to your point about Mr. Rauner giving people money, he's never given me a dime. But, his investments of union money actually have made money for the state. To help the taxpayers. Someone insulted you and said, you are not a patriot. You, not, you are not who you say you are. Well, I'm sorry, I know most of you and a lot of you have worked hard to take this country back and that's what it's all about.